Morning once again, Ronnie. Yes, we are here, and as I said, we are in the heart of the country, here in St. Thomas. And uh, we want to speak to people in the community, people who are making an impact. Now, we know that we have parish ambassadors, and they have the different projects, and they work within the communities. And this young man, he has been a parish ambassador, albeit a few years ago. He's also a street dancer. By a blur, he also is having discussions, open discussions on social media, trying to invoke thoughts and different way of thinking. So, so let me say good morning and welcome to Kerry Mew. Yeah. Kerry, how are you doing, sir? Yes, I'm doing good. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning from Valia. Very good. No, no, you know, I think. Well, well, okay. Okay. Right, right. I know, I know you mentioned that you are a person. 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 No, but when when people, young people, people are, are, are part of that, when people decide to be a parish ambassador, now I know that takes a lot of time, a lot of energy, a lot of dedication. Now, coming out of that there, how has that built you as a young person? How has that helped you to grow as a young person to where you are right now? Yes, well, I, I would say that it, it's a lot of team building exercises uh, pertaining to course masters. Um, that was a public speaking program. Um, it was punctuality, teaching you various aspects of, of punctuality and uh, the importance of making yourself employable, diverse, finding yourself as a young person and, uh, and to attract various employers. Right? So, in itself, I would say that it was a good program and uh, I would encourage anyone to get involved. Now let's fast forward 12 years later now. 12. And yeah, yes, yeah, it's, it's a few years ago. Yeah, yeah. Now, how now has that position? Because you said you know, it helps you to be more community minded and we see what you're doing now. So let's talk about the work you're doing in the community now, the work you're doing because you work with some young people and uh, you continue to reach out to the community. So let's talk about some of that work you're doing. Yes, I uh, started, uh, you mentioned earlier about my street dance stuff like that. So, did a lot of work with Sharon Primary School and Holy Innocent Primary School. And we, last year we won a competition, African Awareness Competition, amongst the primary schools. With the Sharon Primary School back in 2014 15, we won the Junior Dance Fest competition back to back consecutively. And um, yeah, that, that, that is my involvement. Also, also with um, the Years, a little a couple years before before the first uh, master program, it was the school you back, you know, the program. encourage persons to uh, appreciate the tourist attractions in your island, and, and, and you know, basically again, keep that character building confidence to you, you know, about how to be a uh, positive person. Now, how important is it? to really get young people to think that way. How, 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 how important is it you think, to really get the young people to appreciate uh, the, where they are, appreciate the country, appreciate you know, uh, people? Because again, we have the parish ambassadorship and that calls for a lot of community work. It calls for, as you said, team building. And uh, I, I realize you know, sometimes we, we go forward but we don't bring others along. So how, how, how important is it to really get those people to come up with you? Uh, it's important because they, they, they're positive not only about you, your family, but it impacts your country. You know, and as you mentioned, I would have been involved in discussions online and stuff like that. Thinking differently discussions, that is all a podcast that I would have started a couple months ago. And it is important to encourage conversation, to encourage debates. To encourage people to think differently, have different ideas about various topics. It's okay to be wrong. Um, don't feel bad about being wrong. You know, um, there, there, there are points in your life where you may, you may make some errors. Huh? That, that's all it is. What's the reaction being like to those um, Honestly, it's been awesome. Last week we, we talked about uh, sex work and sex tourism. Uh, this week we'll be inviting a guy to speak on marijuana, legalization of marijuana. So, topical issues. Something. Yes, sir. It's things that perhaps people don't necessarily want to talk about, and that can be a core taboo, perhaps. Correct, correct, correct. Yeah, so, yeah we'll, be, we'll be having some fun. 
coming, 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 coming Sunday. Seven thirty Instagram. Please follow me. Here's your and new nine eight nine. Follow. Get involved. Okay, well, we definitely highlight that there. I know that sniper is taking note of that as well. Yes. Now, we are in St. Thomas, and I know you were had to highlight the great elements here in St. Thomas. So, represent your parish now. Talk about this amazing parish I'm getting right now. Well, I, I, I would start by saying, you're in your you're in your of our base. I didn't see you out here. We have the best. We all believe we have the parish of skill. I mean, the, in terms of greenery, you can see it um, St. Thomas. We have the greenery. We have the monkeys I hear people talking about the monkeys. We have the monkeys. You know what? Um, uh, pertaining to tourist attractions, we say that we have the strongest. You know, as our person would uh, compete, try to debate, but yes, that is that is, that is true. Um, we are in the center. We are considered as the heart of Barbados. And I know you all have heard that term multiple times. So come on, we need the heart, we need the arteries, the arteries pump into the heart, we need, we, need, we need it, you know, in order to support Alrighty, so this is a very important part of what we do on VOV, where we come not only to the heart, yes we start in the heart, but we of course highlight the island, which is very important, speaking to the people in the communities, which is why we're here, speaking to the people in the communities, we've been doing that there for 40 years, and we'll continue to do that there. So, what I need you to do, right there, say that there to everyone in VOB country. Yeah, happy 400th anniversary to VOB 92.9. All right, let me try that there again. What are you doing? Let me in the studio now. <laughs> Go again. Happy 400th anniversary to VOB 92.9. VA side. <laughs> and outside. <laughs> There we go. A positive young man, and that's a very important. There's a lot of negativity out there. It's very easy to open the papers. You don't have to open the papers. On the front pages, sometimes you see all the negativity out there. You see all the bad things happening, which is why we need to highlight the positive things in our community. So before we wrap up, anything you want to share with those listeners, both young and not so young? Yeah, encourage discussion. I mentioned earlier, be positive. Not only it's a good thing to be positive to yourself, you also impart your family and your country. And that's important. So stay positive. Keep it real. Carrie Neal, thank you very much. Uh, see you right. I don't know if you dress up for us or if you are uh, going out to work. Yes, I'm out to work. Out to work. Yes, please. <laughs> well, have a fabulous day. Thanks for being a part of our roadshow this morning. Awesome. Thank you too.